a search for Janika Kezia Guerra ended in tragedy on Thursday morning. Her body was found buried in a grave along a riverbank in Maracas Valley, St. Joseph. A joint effort between police officers and hunters led to the discovery of Ms. Guerra's body. Kimberly D'Souza tells us more. Just three weeks shy of her 29th birthday, Janika Guerra's body was found in a grave in Santa Barbara Road, Maracas Valley, St. Joseph. Captain of the Hunters Search and Rescue Team who discovered the body, Balance Rambarat, said 10 members of his team assisted police in the early morning search on Thursday. A couple of hours into the search, um, a discovery was made on the riverbank about 50 feet from the Santa Barbara Road. Um, not far from the police station, actually it's about a five minute drive and um, a body was found in a fairly deepish grave. Janika's boyfriend Dylan Huggins, who was also at the scene when her body was found, said he last saw her alive around 11 a.m. on Saturday. Janika told him she had plans to meet the main suspect's daughter at Kirab Junction to go to the mall. Well, I tell her that I was going to the forest for this weekend for the two days, which is Saturday and Sunday. She said, okay, no problem. She said, well, you know, the summer body month, I hope you can come back with your hands swinging. I said, no, nah, you don't worry about that. I had that covered. And she said, okay, no problem. After that, I didn't hear anything. On Sunday night, when Janika did not respond to his text message, he told a few of her relatives she was missing and made a report to the police. On Wednesday, Janika's bloodied purse was found along the riverbank in Santa Barbara Road. Reports indicate one of the suspects in her disappearance led police to the grave in St. Joseph. The main suspect, however, is said to have committed suicide over the weekend. Dylan was in a relationship with Janika for approximately six months. He described her as a loving person. Never on bad terms, no matter if it is, she's sad. Every time you watch her, if it's, you always see a smile on her face. Can't, I can't say nothing bad about the individual. Dylan thanked members of the search and rescue team for their assistance in locating Janika's body. Kimberly D'Souza, TDT News.